Hey guys, it is the Vinyl Casket. We are back. Sorry I haven't been putting out much videos besides my <clears throat> weekly comic videos, but we are gonna be doing a cool video right now. You can check out my YouTube channel at The Vinyl Casket, all one word, where you can like, comment, and subscribe. Hit that bell. Um, I have tons of content on my YouTube channel that you can check out. And I do have some ideas and trailer reactions I have to do. Uh, but I finally got a Kickstarter. Fully funded and delivered. Uh, I did two. One about a year and a half ago. One earlier. I mean at the end of 2021 I believe. Um, and one of them is finally done. And it's here. I have everything. I have the box. I opened the box. Uh, and we're going to go through it. Um, so I'm very excited. So this is from Top Cow Productions, which is a subsidiary company of Image Comics. Um, and this was a really cool edition of a like very 90s comic title. Um, I thought it was really cool that this was coming out. So I decided to hop on the Kickstarter that was funding this. Um, I believe you can get it. Through like a comic shop and everything also. Um, but it shipped in that box. Uh, this is the white box that it comes in. And we got... A nice cool box. We got bubble wrap. In there. Can you guys see it? Can you see it? It's Cyberforce. We got it. We got some extras. We got some cool stuff. So, very nicely wrapped. We have more of a wrap. And then the volume one of the complete Cyber Force Deluxe Edition for you. Let's, it says image on it, which is interesting. Because I know this is done by Top Cow's uh, Kickstarter. Oh, that's cool. Okay. So, Image Comics owns Top Cow. Top Cow had a Kickstarter. They've done a couple projects so far. And this is their big team book, Cyber Force. Uh, they've done some independent, some independent characters. But this is the first team book they've put out. It says Image... Oh, is there a way to... Yeah. It says Image here. Volume 1. Top Cow is 40 years, 30 years. Uh, and then the spine, obviously, right there. The cover right there. Uh, the back says image and top count in the corners. And on the top, it says Kickstarter. So the one you would buy in stores, I think you can order it, I guess now, uh, would not have the Kickstarter. Um, really cool back cover. Really cool front cover. Um, I just want to see... Oh, okay, so the the hardcover, it's a hardcover, and the hardcover is different than the slipcase. So you have the dust jacket, right? Dust jacket insides are this. Obviously, we saw this, this, and this. That's the dust jacket. And then for the hardcover, oh, we have this cover, which is so different. It's this complete Cyber Force Volume 1. So this is what you get on the slip cover, and this is what you get on the actual hard cover. Um, and the back is completely different. It gives you a little description, the what it contains, which is Cyber Force Zero, Tin Men of War 1 through 4, uh, Killer Instinct crossover with Wildcats 5 through 7, Volume 2, 1 through 13, Origins number 1, Cyblade. Number two, Striker, and Cy Cy Cyber Force Annual Number One. So that gives you a good amount of stuff. Uh, retail price here is uh, forty nine ninety nine. Um, really cool. I like this a lot. Um, and then let's just—that's what you get when you open it up. It's cool. Signed by Mark Silvestri. So it would be a normal black piece of paper, but this is glued on. 
I like that extra little sketch. Um, really, really cool. I love this art style. I love Mark Silvestri, his writing, his art style. Um, right there. Really cool. Really 90s. Awesome. Image and Top Cow were like the best. Like, oh, I love this stuff. I know there's some grifter stuff in here. Right? There's got to be. It does that crossover. There's got to be. Oh, I saw it. Boom. There we go. We got Grifter. A lot of these characters right here are not DC characters, which are really cool. Um, we haven't seen a lot of them been used since Grifter had his Batman Urban Legends. Uh, oh, my. Oh, it does the... Alright, this... Alright, I don't want to... Okay. Let's open it like this, right? You open up the book, you're in the middle of this story, and then... A four-page splash page. A four-page splash. What? Inside... Of the issue. Is there more of this? The so, oh, okay. I'm like, these pages are. Oh my. Oh my god. I I can't believe they did we were able to do this. They have a couple of them. So the regular page just kind of shrinks down a little bit. So you lose a little bit of the of the size on some of the regular pages. You get so much cool stuff here. I've been buying image books like their collected editions like crazy lately. And I've been waiting for this. I've been very excited for this. Oh, that was cool. Alright, so let's put the slip cover back on and let's talk about all the extras that I was able to get with the tier that I signed up for. Um obviously the main part is the book, and that's what really matters. Uh paper quality here is incredible. Um the Hardcover itself is really good. I love the slipcase. Everything here is extra ec excellent qu quality. Um, so then the, all the extras come in this little bag. We'll start with the big one. We have the art print. We have this sick art print. Uh, it's really cool. Oh, it's McFarlane. Okay, sweet. So this is... Is even cooler now. This is a McFarlane art print. That's awesome. Um, and then we have a bunch of extra stuff. I know we have coasters. Here's one coaster. Okay. Oh, they're cardboard though, which I'm no annoyed about. So I definitely can't put anything that's gonna like get wet. Is this one coaster? I thought it was multiple coasters. All right, let's just pull this stuff out. Okay. Uh, we have a bookmark. A double-sided bookmark. We have a postcard. And... This is a trading card. This is a Mark Silvestri Cyber Force trading card. And we have some stickers. Oh, that's sick. So we got the logo, Cyber Force. And we got one of the characters. It's a sick sticker. Oh, this is awesome. These are awesome. They're going right on my cooler, dude. They're going right on my cooler. Um, 
Yeah. So that's awesome. That's everything you, we got. Uh, trading card, postcard, uh, can't think, uh, bookmark, which I'm definitely going to be using, um, and a coaster. Uh, we'll throw that back in this little bag. Along with the McFar Todd McFarlane art print, which is so cool. I need to like frame that. Um, put that, we'll fold that. Put the coaster in here too. I don't want that to get ruined. Right. As, as I struggle to do this. Um, I know I talked about some of the stuff I got the other week, but I'll do another video about that. So that is the complete edition volume one. I am perfectly sure that there will be a volume two, um, cause there's tons of material to collect. Uh, I haven't seen that on there. They just finally published this. So assuming after they finish mailing everything out, they will, advertise volume two like they've done with a bunch of their other characters uh from top cow and i will 100 percent be hopping on that bat bandwagon thank you guys for tuning in this has been the vinyl casket let me know how you guys felt about the video in the comments uh what you guys want me to do in the future any recommendations any trailer reactions any movies to review let me know um we have some trailers I will be re reacting to in the next couple of days. Been doing a lot of overtime and at work and haven't been really around and able to do this stuff. Uh, so thank you guys for hanging in there with me, checking out the channel uh, at the Vinyl Casket, all one word on YouTube, where you can subscribe, like, and comment, hit the bell. Thank you guys so much. And remember to do me a major favor and stay lame.